You're new in town as well? I just moved here a little while ago. Name's Audit. Oh, so glad you came. We're at our wit's end here. I don't know why, but the pan bats have been coming out of the swamp and into our tree farm since last month. Now they're flying all over the farm, preventing anyone from getting near. We've tried everything already. Fire, water, cotton candy, you name it. But they just won't go away. The Civil Corps came the other day, and they're just as cool as us. They've been sucking nutrients and poisoning our trees. Look at them. The leaves are turning brown. You've got to do something. We actually talked with Higgins as well. But he's scared of the pan bats. So it's up to you now. Can you help us? Oh, thank you, thank you. But how do you plan on solving this? Will this actually work? I'm afraid of using relics. The church told us to use as little of them as possible. Bad things happen when they're used. You're afraid of everything. We have no other choice. Go ahead and try it. They actually left. I can't believe it. Here's your commission fee. You've earned it. That actually worked? Wow! Maybe I'll order a couple of these from you in the future. The pan bats took a lot of water and nutrients. We need a fast way of restoring them. We'll commission you for this job. Can you help us? Thanks! Petra mentioned she knew something about an irrigation system before. Maybe you should chat with her. It's working! This is the greatest! Thank you for everything. Here's your commission fee. Now that we're back in business, if you ever need any wood supplies, you can check the box besides our home. We can afford some every day. Dawa is a good person. Simple at times, but a great boss to work for. It's an easy job. I have a lot of downtime, which I used to explore the surroundings. Portia is such a peaceful town. It's quite different from where I've been. It's very refreshing, you know. Just rising up each day and walking through the trees. <sighs> very uplifting.
I like you too. That means we're officially a couple now. Hey, hi. I've been looking for you. Uh, yeah, I need you to make me something. Aided has been waking up in the middle of the night screaming and making a lot of noise. Weird stuff. He even came and pulled my covers off me last night. So, yeah, I gotta do something. Could you make him a new pillow or something? Maybe that'll keep him from waking up? Great! Just get him one as soon as you can. My tree chopping chops are suffocating lately. I stayed in Logos for a while. The people there sure know how to relax. I've seen enough fighting and warfare to last me a lifetime. I just want to settle in a peaceful place and live out the rest of my days. I've been through a lot in my life. You learn to take it easy and not stress about the small things. Ah, I'm really curious about the old world. So, I like to look at old relics whenever possible. I've been around some, wherever there's work. I'd like to settle down, though. <laughs> Maybe this is the place. Thank you. 
what are you? Wait. Oh my god. That's... Yes! I will! By the power given to me by the Holy Spirit, I hereby pronounce you united under the everlasting sun. You look tired. Want a massage? Sweetness, want to go for a walk with me? Sweetness, you've got some nice weather today. Why don't we go have a picnic? Someone's coming. What? One of ours? Didn't look like it. Hide. That must be the thief. Did he follow us here? A lucky day. Not so sneaky now, are you? Who are you? You followed us here, didn't you? Not too far, Smiley. We designed this to hold a rhino, so this thief will be in here for a while. We'll have ample time to ask him questions. For now, I want to see who's under that mask. Are you done? What? Clever setting up a trap like this. That's right. But you made one mistake. We're not dealing with a simple thief here, people. He's a knight! That must be my lucky day. I've always wanted to fight a knight. Cut it out, Arlo. Spread out. We'll take him together. Well, I've had enough fun. I must bid you all farewell. Oh, no, you don't. I insist. Good day. So that was a night. Oh, my dear Reverend Blake, and you said you didn't need any of my help? You. Ah, you're all here. Good, good. Depends on your definition of fun. We just beat your pirate. You're next. No matter. All sources under my control. You're too late. Now, 
Let me give you a demonstration of its power. Stop him! I can't believe they paid me for this. <laughs> you have no right to use this beam like this. Get off! What an annoyance. Oof! Try to flop it over. You know, I've had enough fun for today. All source, teleport. Insufficient energy level. That's... no... Why do you keep fighting me? You're no match for me! Welcome to the real world, and the strong always eat the weak. Well said, young builder. Django? Uncle Django? Who are you? It's not honorable to ask for a name before given one. So useless. Do knots nowadays depend so much on ancient gadgets? So undisciplined. You're a failure of a knot. <laughs> The Lightning Fist? You're the Storm Knight! Do you want any more lessons today? <laughs> no, I can't win against fools. You're letting him go? Yes, I think he's learned his lesson. He'll probably never show his face in Portia again. What a mess! I heard from Dawa that Ardit left right after the battle. Maybe he just didn't want to be in such a dangerous place? Who knows? Now why would Adit just get up and leave? It can't be that he's the rogue knight, right? I have a suspicion that Adit was the rogue knight. It's just a feeling, since I have no proof. But he did leave right after the battle, so... I'm hearing a rumor that Adit's the rogue knight. I have no proof, though, so I can't run with it. So Adit never came back. He left a note saying he has something to do and left. Maybe he'll be back someday. And no, he's not the rogue knight. I'd never believe that. Sometimes, I think my past will catch up with me here in Portia. It keeps me awake at night. Oh, I, I didn't mean to worry you about it, though. I love you.